Hello everybody, good morning, good night, good evening, whenever you are watching this video, when the chickens lay their eggs. <laughs> I don't know what, I don't know where to go with that, but when um when the rooster starts squawking shh. Come on Daisy. Come on. I'm just torn for a little bit. Oh, did she fart? Uh, okay, um, well, I have a guest with me, my cat here, because I'm going to discuss, um, some stuff that's been going on in the past couple, or three, or several weeks. Um, okay, I'll let you go. I'm sorry, just, just woke her up from her sleep, just so you guys could, um, hear or whatever, if you, can, if you could hear. But, yeah, basically, there's been a lot of stuff going on in the past weeks. Um, a lot of problems, a lot of inconveniences. So I thought I would share that with you guys today through my commentary. And by the way, FYI, I am hosting this game if you are um, curious at all. But there's been a lot of problems going, not problems, I shouldn't say problems, but a lot of significant things. Um, for one, it's the end of school, obviously. Let's say it is the 20th when I'm recording this, and school ended on the 15th. So yeah, very long time from end of school um, on that note though school was um, wasn't too fun the ending wasn't so special but on the bright side of that I got a nice award for our eighth grade um, promotional ceremony which was fantastic very fun and felt like a minority there <laughs> but um yeah uh, I got a nice award called the perseverance award which is an award for motivation, determination, and, you know, always wanting to succeed and, you know, trying to achieve something, which I got only six or five other people, I believe six in total, got that award, that type of award. So, you know, it made me feel special because I, I never gotten a trophy before. But, um, yeah, it was very nice to get it. And... The award, I believe, was made out of plastic. The base was marble, and the plastic trophy base, or the bottom of the trophy, um, the actual trophy itself, I believe, was uh, plastic and metal. Like, that's right above the marble base, just to kind of, um, I don't know, suit it as the trophy base itself. But basically, um, you know, it was a very, very uh, goldish, plastic-looking, dollish um, trophy with uh, a sticker. <laughs> yeah, it's so nice to got it. I, I, when I was really trying to dissect the trophy after I got it, it was plastic, marble, and metal with a sticker <laughs> and a plaque which they spelled perseverance wrong which made me laugh i mean i wish they could i'm just happy they spelled my name right because my last name is a little tricky but you only know that but yeah my last name is tricky and that's all i'm gonna say but yeah fortunately for me they spelled my name right which is always um, died there by ram the bot yeah but fortunately they spelled it right which was good for me because a lot of people get my um name spelled wrong my last name but fortunately, yeah, they got it. But they spelled perseverance wrong, which is I believe how they spelled it is P E R S E R V A N C E. But they spelled it I mean that's how they spelled it, but the correct way of spelling it is P E R S A V E R A A um, N C E, I believe if I'm not mistaken. But yeah, overall the end of school was pretty good especially the promotional ceremony since there's about you know, there was probably about what am I saying yeah there was probably about only 20 awards given out and the rest all got pins so I was you know very lucky because I was one of the few people and I right after I got the award I was being greedy in my head thinking oh, I would love to get another award but then I said to myself you know why be greedy half the people in the school or the majority you should stay yeah uh, got or didn't get awards and there's 264 eighth grade students in my well yet yeah, in my school and only 20 or 30 got an award so yeah it's really really low um, then the week after that or two weeks after that 
I found out that my Razer Anza controller tournament edition was defective thanks to you know the company. <laughs> Good job company. But um yeah I found that it was defective two weeks after or probably not a month and two weeks after I believe somewhere around there. I found out that it was defective unfortunately which means I had to send it back and my Xbox also was breaking down if you haven't noticed which I was going to talk about um, in this video but basically what happened was I was um, my Xbox or whatever had like a system um, malfunction or whatever where the disc or the sensor for the disc tray when it reads the disc wasn't um, playing the games properly and they kept saying like five minutes after you get into the game um, after you start it, that you would actually, that you, basically you can't play it, which was, you know, very bad, because I couldn't play Gears of War 2, and that's probably one of my most played games currently right now, until Gears of War 3 and all the other big title games, which, by the way, how come, uh, I would love to, for someone to answer this question, how come games are not released um, during the summer when kids are at home and even you know teenagers you know seniors freshmen all that stuff how come game developers release it before you know right before all the holidays start to kick in you know halloween um thanksgiving christmas all that stuff hanukkah whatever um holiday you celebrate but yeah unfortunately i have to send both of those back the razor controller and the xbox i mean what are you gonna do you can't get a new one but the good news is even though my keyboard was defective, which I got from Newegg.com, which is a very good place, very um, um it's kind of like Amazon, except I believe they only deal with electronics. But um, yeah, I got some from Newegg, or my dad did, and it was defective. Um, from the company Logitech, it was the keyboard or a Logitech keyboard which has laid up. Button. I believe I told you guys about this like, two commentaries ago whenever I did my last commentary but um what happened is my dad got the Razer controller from Newegg and basically I was able to keep the <laughs> which is really funny I was able to keep my Logitech uh, my first one that was defective and what the company did is they sent another one they asked Logitech to send another keyboard or whatever and basically I have two keyboards and it turned out that none of them were defective because it's just that this keyboard isn't compatible with um, the computer or whatever completely um, but yeah I'm hoping that I'll get another controller or two controllers because then I'll be able to play the defective one or whatever until it comes until the second one comes but basically what happened with the first one um, in my or on my controllers that every time with the left thumbstick I pushed up it would always go down like even in any direction and it was really hard for me to play especially like when you're in cover and Gears of War 2 say uh, what would happen is you would be in cover then you just get off and it would kind of mess up your game so I'm forced to play on the Air Girl 360 control unfortunately but um, anyway I talked about the effective things the school ah one last thing which is very important so what I'll probably be doing is uh, I'll put a, in the top right corner of the screen I'll put what uh, my cat looks like but basically two or three days ago my cat ate like grass and assuming pesticides I'm not 100% sure but basically the grass had pesticides it caused him to get sick and he's an outdoor cat so he he went out we didn't see him for a day because we figured you know he, he'll do that sometimes on us his name is Tiger our cat is that right Daisy you know he, your brother but um yeah talking to my cat um but yeah what happened is he i think he ate pesticides on the grass he's an outdoor cat so he went out we didn't see him for a day we, that's normal sometimes but then we didn't see him on the second day and then we found him we went searching for him on the evening because we thought he was sick and it turned out that he was from eating the pesticides so what happened is we couldn't find him and we got nervous because we thought he was dead because there's a little crawl space um, at the bottom of a place where he could be but it was all spiders and cobwebs so we didn't go in there but yeah he wasn't in there after we looked 
So then we started w walking around the next day, and we, you know, fortunately we found him. We ran to him, and he started meowing. But he's a very smart cat. Um, I everybody loves him in the family. Um, he's one of my favorite cats. Don't tell other cats, but yeah, just a little joke. Um, yeah, but basically he's a very, very nice cat, and we're very ha proud and happy that he's okay, which is fortunate because we thought honestly that he was dead. Um, but yeah, he, he's a typical cat if you saw by the picture. There's a lot like him. If you go by one guy named um, the Mean Kitty, he has a cat just like the cat I have that got. Um, that's um, the smart level cat that um, eat the pesticides. I'm assuming. But yeah, anyway, this video is wrapping up. I hope you enjoyed me commentating over this Gears of War 2 game. And I will see you guys in one second once we reach the subscribe. Okay, there we go. Well, basically, we, we end up winning. Um, very good game of 14 and 3. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye. Please rate, comment, and subscribe.